We wish to thank the people of Bosnia for the opportunity to present the aims and direction of the Venus Project. What is desperately needed in our society today is concern for people and the environment. Oh, we have plenty of paper proclamations and laws concerning this, but it does not manifest itself into society. If we're really concerned with people and the environment, we need to address the problems directly. We will attempt to provide for the needs of all people by the redesign of our cities in a resource-based economy in which all the world's resources are shared equally. Money and politics have proven to be interference factors to achieve these ends. And the resource-based economy declares all the Earth's resources as the common heritage of all the world's people. We need to apply directly the scientific method of operation to the way we live. And in doing that, we can arrive at closer approximations of reality. We have the resources today to feed, house, and clothe everyone on the planet, but we're locked into old ways of doing things and a value system that supports these destructive tendencies. The benefit of attending our lectures will be the presentation of a resource-based economy and how it affects human behavior and values. We are very excited to have the opportunity to present a new updated method of operation for a sustainable global society. And any plans of this magnitude do have to be global. The end of separate nation and the artificial boundaries that separate people. When radiation hit Japan, it went all over the globe. It had no respect for the artificial boundaries that we set up today. When the banks fail in Europe, there are repercussions all over the world. We cannot live to ourselves anymore. We want to see a world which is managed for the benefit of people. The Venus Project presents a new socio-economic system that introduces methods and procedures to achieve these ends. It is neither free enterprise nor any of the older systems. What dictates our decisions are the needs of the people, the carrying capacity of the earth, and the preservation of the environment. This is quite different than how we plunder our planet's resources today when money is in the scenario and the bottom line is profit. There are no final frontiers or no end goal or utopias. There is a better system awaiting us. This conference will explore new possibilities for a world without war, poverty, hunger, or politics.